Do you like chemistry? Do you want to pursue it as a research career? How? Haven't got any satisfactory answers yet? Let's find out from the researchers themselves. Not just that, let's feel as they feel it. Let's experience as they experience it. Let's see theoretical chemistry as they see it. That's an interesting question because I'm actually still in the process of becoming a scientist. So I'm see I'm a master student and I'm now doing an internship as a preparation for my actual master thesis here at the MPI. But to be honest, I feel really um, comfortable and happy about what I'm doing. Um, although everything developed in a very unexpected way, my past my scientific past was very. Uh, a very experimentalist past and then I s suddenly switched into that di uh, different field but it's really a lot of fun doing that and I just realized more and more that this is really the thing I want to do and I really want to do for my life. I mean that's what I say now, let's see how it looks like in 10 years but <laughs> yeah, I'm really happy um, with being a part of yeah, scientific research. Uh, well, first of all, I need to tell you people that this is not exactly what we do in science. Just walking with the back bang near the riverfront. Uh, it's a weekend, so we are just you know, having a hang, a, a good hangout here. I would say it's quite, it's quite good. It's quite good to be a scientist. For example. I mean, I, I never thought that I would be, I would, I would start my career in a research field. Apart from that, it's so novelistic experience. You find that you are something, you are, you, you are one of the intellectual species. You know, you, you start, you try to learn from them, you try to implement things, and you try to unravel the mysteries of nature. That is how I feel at being a scientist. Apart from that, being a scientist, uh, I would say it's a very cool job that you learn new things. You learn things of your own choice and then you implement whatever you want. Only the, only the serious part is you have to convince the scientific community what you are doing. Okay, because it's like, it's not just you, you, you do cool stuff, go around and publish whatever you, you find that's not so easy is why it is fun for me because because as, as a child I always thought that scientific I, I've always dream dream about scientists as a as a sci-fi character for example just like Mr. Fantastic Mr. Fantastic was always a better scientist for me Dr. Doom who has far more advanced degree compared to Mr. Fantastic so science was so fascinating for me and now since I'm studying it being a scientist though I'm not a well-established scientist let me tell you that that I'm not a well-established scientist but yes I'm a student of science which we which we are always which we will be throughout our life everybody is a student of science and they remain student of science throughout their life but yes it's a really cool experience to learn science to implement the scientific concept and to stumble upon something novelistic there is a transformation for example you study more scientific concepts and you more scientific concepts you study more fascinated you get by the scientific concepts and more curiosity can be developed learning new things learning or probably uh, unraveling the uh, unraveling the natures and natural phenomena I enjoy being a scientist because it lets my creativity out. I do not have to work on a fixed schedule. Being at work at 9 o'clock, going home at 1700 hours, I have can set my 
dates, I can set my time, I can just let my inner spirit out. And also it's very rewarding to be able to think about nature or ways to describe nature and solve nature's puzzles and problems. It's a uh, reward that you do not get in a typical boxed in kind of job, I would say. I guess like uh, I take this as like uh, in any other job that we have set of goals and um, but uh, yeah like I was talking about freedom that I think the main difference here is that we have a lot of freedom as to we have to come up with our own projects we can uh, proceed as we see fit and uh, I guess that's the more like the major difference between like uh, working like in a company Oh, it's actually fun. Being a scientist is not a job in a general sense. Uh, you're doing your hobby and you make a profession out of it. So if you like solving problems, if you like um, working on the topic that you're working on, then this is a very generous, happy experience, actually. There's a lot of work involved, there's no question about that. Science is not just fiddling around with your problem and solving something and doing experiments or simulations. Um, it's also publishing, convincing people of the importance of your work and your results. And um, both of us can be fun as well, but there's also a lot of work involved, there's no question. But basically there's nothing else that we want to have. I can't imagine myself doing some anything else. Since I was a child, I always wanted to be a scientist. I remember I was always watching uh, Carl Sagan and those people uh, uh, talking about science. I love it. And basically, the only thing that they know how to do is science. <laughs>